Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Today, we're going to be playing with style. Stay tuned. Good morning, everybody. Um, coffee sponsor of today is Maria Esquavius. E S Q U I V I A S Maria. Maria writes, I love coffee and tennis too. I watch you from Tibet to Tepatilan, T E P A T I T L A N, Tepatilan. Uh, Jalesco, Mexico, started on tennis late at my 44 years, uh, two years ago. So you started at age 44, which was two years ago. I get you. Um, I like to compete more with myself, feeling that I'm getting good in something. I like softball and bowling too. Oh, thank you, Maria. I like bowling too. And I used to play softball many many moons ago so we got a lot in common uh, tennis will definitely be great for you especially for your fitness exercise and the most important thing fun okay so don't forget to have fun out there um, yeah all right so enjoy the game thank you for the coffee if you want to be my coffee sponsor of the day network is buymeacoffee.com forward slash tennis spin you want to just hook up the channel super thanks is the way link is below thank you so so much yeah might get back to bowling myself actually <laughs> an easier sport all right we got new racket from my friends over at lacoste Play, still playing with style, guys. But it is now green. Look at that. I wonder if they made it green because, you know, crocodiles are green. Alligators are green. Um, it's kind of a forest green, actually. Wow, looks like a redesign. Interesting. I'm going to show you real quick this picture. It's their new handle that's supposed to be great for shock dampening, um, but will enhance the feel. So it'll give you feel and take out um, the shock that is supposedly bad for you. So Technofiber engineered the racket, as you can see by up top here. And, uh, for Lacoste, and this is the L23. Oh my gosh. Harry, you played well. Oh. Thank you, coach. Been feeling really good lately. That second set, you really came alive. What was it? Strings, grip, shoes, what? It's actually this electrolyte mix from my friends at RTP called Second Wind. Wow. I pop that into my water bottle, shake it up, and I'm good to go. Wow. That's my other win. So here are the characteristics of the L23. 100 square inches. 23 inches long, 315 grams strung, which is 11.1 .1 ounces. It's 328 millimeters on the balance, which is five points head light. So that's strung. Swing weight is 318. RA, which is the stiffness, is 69. Now the beam is 
23, 25, 23. 16 by 19 string pattern. Recommended string tension is 51 to 55. Those numbers sound very, very familiar. Um, I feel like those numbers reminisce a lot of popular rackets on the market right now, especially the beam, the head size, the weight, the everything. <laughs> I'm going to actually string this with NRG, which is a technofiber string on the softer side, uh, 53 pounds, which is right down the middle, 16 gauge, and you know, kind of see how it goes. Okay, so let's go play with style and we'll see you on the court. We just played with style in this sleek green new well newly designed newly formulated newly built racket from lacoste the new l23 coach goo thank you i don't know if i told you but um it's nrg at 50 three pounds, 16 gauge. Okay? Gotcha. That's what I'm imagining that this racket would be strung at for the type of player that may purchase it. That's why I strung it that way. That's okay. why I didn't do a poly. Okay. okay. I just want to right. make sure. Just okay. want to make sure. Cool. Thanks, Coach. Thank you. Go for it. Um, overall, I think this is a solid racket. I think we did a similar review to this racket before. Um and it's definitely updated. It definitely feels different compared to the other version I think we played with. Um, biggest change I noticed is if you actually take a closer look at the string pattern or the string bed here, it looks like rectangles. Um, in my opinion, they've done something different. I have never seen kind of a string bed that looks like rectangles like this. Um, maybe it's, it has some type of technology. Maybe it has more control, could be more power. I think more on the control aspect and maybe spin versatility. Um, but surprisingly, it played really well. It almost plays very similarly to a pure drive. Um, it has a lot of pop. Interesting thing I found out about this racket when I was playing with it, it has control. It's easy power, but also it has that control that you need, especially with a powerful racket. Um, but other than that, I mean, Technofiber with Lacoste, with this type of racket, is a great update to it. Uh, so, genuinely surprised with this racket overall. Okay, let's, let's hand it over to All right, Coach Chris here. Hey, it's your racket. <laughs> have fun. Uh, yeah, again, Lacoste rackets are really sticking with their motto of playing in style, and I think this racket really does it. But now, it's got good performance um, enhancements to back it up, I think. After hitting with this one, the L23, uh, first thing that came to mind is that you definitely get more stability and power with this with this nice um, upgrade. I definitely like the aesthetic that they're going for here too as well. This nice green. This, again, uh, a lot of power, good spin too, and I was more impressed with just the performance aspect of it. I think it does a really good job of trying to... Um, compete with all the other ones all the other kind of powerful rackets that you've got out there but it's a lot more st stable i do feel a bit of a flex point too as well um and other than that i feel like out of all the other powerful rackets it's out of the other hundreds this one um feels quite you know um quite well effortless in terms of what you want to do with with the plow through and swing so um i agree with both of you in that it feels very familiar it it's like most 300 gram rackets that are unstrung with you know this type of uh, thickness mm -hmm. and head head shape uh, 
like what you said, like a pure drive. It's very similar to that uh, layup, that style, that playability. There is a little more feel to this one, though. Um, I feel like when I strung it at 53, I, I had a feeling that it would be too tight. Um, obviously not for us, but for the person who may buy this, I feel like 48 would probably be more of the sweet spot for the person who buys it is my guess. Mm -hmm. and, and I'm obviously thinking of um, possibly a female, but this, this particular racket can definitely suit um, all types of players. You got your weekend warriors, any type of a 3.0 to possibly like a 4.5 would definitely benefit from this racket. Um, if we stuck Polly in here, I'm sure we would all be giving it rave reviews. Again, it's, uh, I think they did a really good job with the performance side of things for Lacoste this time. I, I really think this racket, like Harry said, feels more familiar. So you can definitely come and pick it up and play. And I think you'd be, you'd be pretty happy and satisfied with, with the, this, this Lacoste racket for sure. Right. So we're not just looking great on the court. We're feeling great on the court. And we're probably playing great on the court with this uh, particular model too. I mean, yeah, I think this is a great update from what we played with last time. And they definitely, they, yeah, cosmetic wise looks simple and minimalistic and clean, but it does play like an actual racket, like a racket that most players will actually play with. So yeah, it's, it's a surprising racket and a surprising update. I think they went the right route with this for sure. Definitely great redesign, um, great update great playing racket all right so that's the l23 by lacoste give it a shot especially if you like the cosmetics all right coach goo you got the mic where can we find you you can find me at agu.tennis also be posting content there as well coach chris you can find me at cb chen tennis and that's that's it right. still my line guys thank you for watching tennis spin where we put our spin on your tennis